Hey everybody and welcome back to Investment Honey where we talk about various crypto projects. Before we begin, I want to let you know that I'm not a financial advisor. I do not provide financial advice on the channel and I don't even encourage you to invest. But what I'm going to do is share with you my own personal opinion and views on the projects discussed on the channel. So we're looking at Okapi um, and they do have a pre-sale coming up. You know, So just want to let you know, here is their official pink sale pre-sale page. Again, this is a pre-sale, not a fair launch. You know, So they do have an audit badge here. As far as the audit is concerned, they did pass with no higher medium severity issues, and this is going to be upcoming. And the pre-sale is going to start in just over three days from the time you're doing the video. So with that being said, um, again, this is a pre-sale, not a fair launch. You know, So with it being a pre-sale, we do get that hard cap here. So it's 120 BNB on you know regarding their uh, their hard cap. We also see um, we've got their socials here. It says a copy network um, contract ownership is with Pink Sale, Safeu, Dev, world's first charity crypto token exclusively made for the conservation of unique copies. One percent tax goes to beautiful copies. NFT minting is live. Copy staking live. Ownership announced at launch. Contract audited by analytics, audits, uh, professional marketing team to ensure safety of holders. CGCMC at launch, low tax 4 and 4 on the fees. Token tax exemption to NFT holders, DAX tools, AVIDAX trending at launch, low cap with 100x potential. Okay, so we also get a video here to engage with, but you guys know that we don't uh, we don't take a look at videos as we explore projects on the channels. Um, we also see this is going to be whitelisted only here. Minimum buy is going to be 0.1 and the max is going to be 0.8. So I think that looks good. Um, and then we see the rate of tokens in the pre-sale is going to be 35,000. Same for, you know, listing on PancakeSwap, you know, which is good. Uh, the initial market cap, that's estimated at 58851. And the soft cap is highlighted again at 50 BNB here. And then the hard cap at 120 BNB. Liquidity lockup time, I've gone ahead and highlighted this in the concerns and red flag section because anything under 365, typically that's what I will do, unless they get pretty close, you know, to that 365, you know, but 187 is too far away from it. So um, the standard a lot of, you know, for a lot of projects these days is 365, you know, so that's the reason why I highlight it there, which is consistent with a lot of other projects that I've covered. And we see the token metrics and we get a sliver of unlocked tokens, you know, 0.84%. Um, you know, so if the team can go ahead and explain, you know, what's going on with those unlocked tokens, that would be helpful. Just engage, you know, um, with the video in the comment section. So we're going to transition on over to the documentation. So here we go, taking a look at the tokenomics and the distribution information. We got 42% going to pre-sale, 20% going to liquidity, 10% going to the burn, 10% going to token staking, 10% to NFT staking, and then we got 6% going to community airdrop, and 2% to pink sale. Okay, and then we get some vesting information here as well. All right, and then the fee structure, so they give you that 4 and 4. I'm explaining that 2% of that 4% is going to be going to marketing, 1% to the charity, and 1% going to rewards, weekly giveaways, and community contests. So looking at their roadmap, we see the phases here. So we got five phases. Okay, we also see some check marks indicating, you know, uh, progress indicators, essentially, you know, what they've already done, which is good to see. We're going to go to stage two. We see crypto marketing campaign, community engagement campaign, contract creation and testing, staking developments and testing contract, deployment, contract verification, audit confirmation, KYC confirmation, fair launch marketing campaign, and pre-sale funding. In stage three, we see charity, PDE launch, launch, DEX tools, information, updated list on client market cap, coin, gecko, 500 plus holders. But again, they don't really need that hold account. One second, guys. I just needed to sneeze real quick. All right, so $1 million on the market cap. Again, don't need this aspirational number here. Everybody wants to grow a market cap. YouTube campaign, Twitter campaign, DAO creation and development. Stage four, again, that aspirational number here that's not needed. Crypto marketing agency, partnerships, uh, the charity, more charity, uh, animated movie launch, uh, crypto expo partnerships, crypto influencer partnerships, more utilities released. And we got some exchanges here. So this one, this is the project that's actually, you know, highlighting, you know, what exchanges they're going after. So uh, they want to get listed on Hotbit, BitMart, and Gate.io. And then in stage five, Shibarium Bridge, ETH Bridge, and Arbit, Arbit, ARB Bridge. Let's just go ahead and say that. Okay, so they're looking to go cross-chain. Okay, so a lot of interesting things, a lot of aspirational things they want to do in terms of the roadmap. Let's move on over to the main page. We see their links in the navigation bar. 
Uh, we also see them talking about, you know, about the token. So it's the world's first charity crypto token exclusively devoted to the conservation of the rare and unique Okapi species. It stands for the fir- uh, Okapi stands as the first of its kind, bringing together investors and cons- conservationists to help protect and preserve these magnificent creatures for generations to come. Okay, so and we got some buttons here to mint uh, chart here. Uh, and then for the pre sale white paper. So um, this, these two are not are not linked. Doesn't look like it, but mint and white paper are linked. Okay. So and then they give you information in regards, you know, to the NFTs, the swap, and staking. Okay. Uh, we also see a graphic here: staking, marketplace, exchange, trade, and NFTs. All right. And then we get some additional information, you know, in regards to um, essentially. Um, different stages, you know, of what's going on uh, with the with the project, you know, and then we get some distribution information, you know, in the vesting periods, which we've already gone over that. So, um, so beyond that, we get a trailer here, you know, for the project, which you guys already know you can engage with that beyond the video, and the roadmap, you know, which we've already kind of touched on, you know, but we want to see timelines, right? We want to see timelines. We want to see progression, you know, indicators, you know, what you've already completed, what's pending on going. Um, you know, and so forth. And we also want to know whether we're getting any additional value at the end of the token in regards to maybe a V2, you know, on the, um, you know, on the, on the roadmap. So moving forward, we see core team is not photo docs, you know, but again, we do, um, we, we, we are waiting to hopefully see, you know, a certificate of KYC since we don't get a badge here. Um, but I did highlight this, you know, in the uh, in the concerns and red flags, you know, that we don't see a certificate of KYC yet. And I do believe I also check took a look, you know, in the um, in the Telegram, you know, for that as well. So and I didn't see it, at least not at the time of doing the video. So just be aware of that. So okay, well that's going to take us through uh, to the end of this uh, the content to cover on the main website page. And keep in mind, again, this is going to go live in just over three days from now. So if this is something you're interested in or do you, you know, feel you know, strongly towards, you know, conservation you know, and what the aim and goal of the project is, by all means, just make sure that you engage, you know, with as much information as you can regarding the project so that you are operating from an informed position as we always talk about on this channel. So thank you so much, you know, for watching. And as always, ladies and gentlemen, you all enjoy the day.